I think it was just for girls. You know, back in those days, it was pretty raw. Guys ran everything. It was a guy world, and um, we, as a group of women, felt we were all ready to bond together and help each other, and not just help get each other work, but help prepare each other. You know, because guys don't know what we go through. You know, they don't wear high heels, and they don't. You know, just. And, you know, it's to this day, it's still going. Although I belong to uh, the United Step Women's Association now. But it's the same, there's the same, we just have less members. It, it's, you know, help them, groom them, bring them up, teach them. You know, if they're, t I was one of the ones that helped Debbie Evans and Donna Evans in, into Hollywood. It's because I saw their raw talent, and Zoe, from you, you, you can see whether or not anybody has has what it takes. Um, and it's a lot of things. They have to have personality. They have to have, um, you know. And we've always been really, you know, without getting too intimate. You always try to keep the people to knowing that sleeping around with these stunt guys or these coordinators. That's your first mistake, you know. I mean, unless you're madly in love with him and you're going to get married to him, which doesn't happen, because it weakens our strength as as women who are offering you something with talent and substance behind it. And you know, you can take take what you want with it and do it. And I think most of the girls today are very. Um, well, they're, they're much more serious about what they do. It isn't all about, let's go out and have a party, you know, let's work all day and go to the local bar. Or when we get in from a long day out in the um, west, riding horses, driving teams, we'll go back to the room and, but it's the way it was. No bad, no good. It's evolved into a better thing, although, I'm not as active as I used to be. I, I still do give advice, and I, I still do go out and help girls do stunt work. Because a lot of times, they're afraid to ask. Because asking means they're weak. See, I've never been afraid to ask anything. And, you know, because I want to know. But I, I know that feeling as if I ask and I'm brand new, darn. So you go out and kill yourself. Now what? Break a leg or whatever. But it takes a long time for people to get that in their heads, that, that asking for help. So, so it started out as asking us girls to help each other. Then we formed and then, and then the guys actually liked it because now they could call me or whoever was president at the time and say, we want da-da-da-da-da girl, and they knew they were gonna get sent the right girl.